welcome back to my project 13 thanks for coming on by and checking out this video product review video huge shout out to Cohen for sending me the Cohen se7 active noise canceling Bluetooth wireless headset foldable headset but we're gonna check that out during the unboxing now as always down below in the description area there will be a link hit that link take it over to Amazon and it's there that you're gonna see the price point a little under $95 and a lot of information for you to read do your homework by the end of this review, you'll know my opinion. Will it be enough for you to want to buy this headset? I don't know. We'll see. Let's unbox the Cohen SE7s. Really digging the carry case here. This is pleather, it is not leather, but it feels really good in hand. Looks great. Cohen brand name up front, but more importantly than that, they're going to protect your SE7s. And that that's really the important part. But I love the fact that Cohen includes, for the most part, with most of their headsets, a carry case. And they're all a bit different. Some a little better than others, but they're still going to work to protect your investment inside all the contents i went through this during the unboxing so i'm not going to do that again we're going to zip that up and put this to the side the star of the show the cohen se7 is going to do a quick overview on this headset in just a moment here check out that glimmer the shimmer that is beautiful but first i wanted to give you a visual comparison next to the cohen e8s the cohen e7 pros red my portland trailblazer headset and now the Cohen SE7s. Very bold look. Edgy bold look. A soft bold look. These all swivel. All three of these. But these are the only ones that actually fold. Now I've had other headsets from Cohen that I reviewed. And a couple earbuds. But I've given those away to my family members. No reason to hold on to all of those headsets if I'm not going to be able to use them all. And the great thing about my family members using those products is I've had no negative feedback whatsoever. So that's a thumbs up. Before we get into the quick tour of the SE7s, I wanted to give you a little information on the audio. You have APTX Hi-Fi technology, low latency, good fault tolerance, high sound quality. 90 decibels of deep, powerful, and crisp sound. Basically, the audio that's going to be fed into your ears should be amazing. Amazing. Also, Bluetooth 5.0. That's going to give you a quick and stable connection with your Bluetooth-enabled devices. The syncing process with my Cohen headsets has been very simple and easy. No issues whatsoever. Okay, with that being said, you have a mic right there. USB charging port area, not Type-C. You also have an 800 milliamp battery 
Should give you up to 30 hours of playtime when fully charged. Volume down. Go back a track. Power button. Also the area that you're going to receive a phone call and disconnect from your phone call. My experience with my other Cohen headsets when receiving phone calls has been good. Very good. Thumbs up. No issues whatsoever. I don't get a lot of phone calls when I'm wearing my headsets, but when I have, I've had no issues. Volume up. Skip ahead of track. LED light is blue when powered on. Switch here for your active noise canceling option. I don't see that I'm going to have any issues with these, but if I run into anything, I'll let you know. In this video, we're going to be checking out the Cohen E7 Pro. That's right, I said Pro. These are new from 2018, but are they worth the upgrade? Let's find out. find a reviewer whose tastes align with your own, but we haven't seen much reviewer data on Kodak quality. Most articles and reviews just parrot the manufacturer press releases. So if Qualcomm and Sony are making claims on performance, it would be nice if we could confirm those claims. I like numbers, and I also like fair comparisons. Like testing two different pairs of cans already skews the data. It's good stuff. Maylene and the Sons of Disaster. A little thrash metal on my Cohen SE7 Bluetooth active noise canceling wireless headphones. So that sounded really good. Foldable. Audio quality. It's amazing. It's amazing. And if you are using the active noise canceling option, even more amazing. While doing dishes, doing laundry, Dogs barking in the background, planes flying overhead. We have planes that fly overhead of our home. Cancels a lot of that out. Yeah, you can still hear some, some sounds, a little bit of that noise, but for the most part, it's muffled out and it sounds amazing. The quality of the audio that's being fed into my ears, I just get to enjoy everything that much more. Very comfortable, top of my head, laying in bed at night, listening to music watching movies, videos, the last few days. These are lightweight, very lightweight in comparison to my other Cohen headsets. And they're smaller, so it's that much more comfortable while I'm laying in bed. So these are gonna be my favorite as far as laying in bed and utilizing this, this headset while listening to music, watching movies and videos. Uh, latency, no latency. That clip right before I came on, hopefully you enjoyed that. I purposely made that a um, couple videos just to show you that the audio was in sync with my OnePlus device, my OnePlus 6T, and the Cohen SE7s. Okay, so no latency, no lag, the audio was perfectly in sync. And that's been what's been going on while watching movies as well. So no issues there whatsoever. So we went over the quality build, very solid, very easy to use, very lightweight, very comfortable. The um, noise active noise canceling option working great uh receiving a phone call one phone call power button press that receive the phone call got the conversation out of the way press that again and ended my phone call and went back to listening to music okay very simple easy the audio quality was good i can't say it was great but it was good got the job done and that's what i need in case i get a phone call while using this headset the volume buttons uh up or down is the area that you're also going to skip ahead of track or go back. If you're watching a video or movie, if you want to go to the next movie or go back to the previous movie, you're going to have to long press to skip ahead or go back. About a second. Okay? Same action whether it's up or down. As far as the volume increasing or decreasing, you have to rapidly press. Okay? So very simple functionality, very simple to sync to your Bluetooth device. I don't know what else to say besides that these, I almost dropped them, these are just great. Great. Under 95 smacks. It's another option in a, in, in a slew of headphones that are out there. You have to do your homework. You have to choose. Thanks again. I'm going to get back to listening to my Maylene and Sons of Disaster. Disaster. 